the next thing that we're going to do, <clears throat> I'm gonna take this post out right here on the video and let's see what's going on with the insulator that is supposed to be there. Let me prop this up. So let's go ahead and take this post out. The nut is finger tight, totally loose. And we'll remove this post. And you can see where that post was actually touching the case of the alternator. Which would ground it out, short it out, fry the regulator, and make it either not charge at all, or undercharge, or overcharge, you know, either way. This is bad. Let's see what we have going on here with this nut on the back. We'll remove that. Why is that not there? I'm sure this one's well toasted. I'm sure it is. Let's take this screw, this bolt out of the case, and see what's going on here. All right, that is not the wrong screw for that position. Uh, I think the threads are quite boogered up. The screw was too long and the shoulder of the screw, yep, that's screwed up. The threads are screwed up because the shoulder of the screw went all the way through the regulator into the case and too deep. The screw isn't the right one for that application. This screw here is not even tightened down. Yeah. So the diode trio wasn't even hooked up, and that is the wrong that is the wrong screw for that location. And let's go ahead and remove this. This is why this alternator is not working. There's a, there's a lot of reasons why. Let me go ahead and take this out. Let me set this phone down.